Hi everyone, this is Jen Taylor, and I'm going to show you how to put social media icons in your email signature. Now, I travel all over the United States teaching people how to market their business online, and I probably get asked this question at least 10 times a day, so I'm finally making a video. <laughs> now, let's get started. Um, I want you to open up Microsoft Word. Now, as you can see, I already pre-wrote my salutation and contact information. I've actually even inserted some images. But let's go find those social media icons we're so desperately looking for. Now, I like Google, so I'm going to go search it in Google. I'm going to type in social media icons. Click Enter. Now, I want to see if there's more. So, I don't know if you've ever noticed this, but there's an image button at the very top of Google. There's more, for, but for time's sake, I'm just going to click on one. I don't know what this one is. Now, it kind of brings up a, a general image. I'm just going to exit out of there. Now, on the page somewhere, there's usually a download button, which this looks like this is it right here. Now, I've already actually pre-downloaded them and um, put them on my desktop here. So, now I want you to open up Microsoft PowerPoint. I know we're going all over the place today, but this is the fastest way that I know how to do it. I want you to highlight this, right-click it, copy, go to Microsoft PowerPoint, use the blank sheet, or slide, right-click, paste, and I want you to hold down the shift key and go to the right-hand corner or one of the corners and shrink it down. Hold the shift key. Don't forget to hold the shift key and let go. Now, I kind of want to space it out to see what this looks like. That looks okay. It doesn't really matter how you're spacing it in PowerPoint. So I'm going to select it all, right click, copy. Let's go back to Microsoft Word and let's insert it somewhere. I probably want it right here. Right click, paste, and Let's see. I'm going to space it out just because I'm a perfectionist. Maybe I want it spaced like that. Okay. Now I'm going to select all of this, right click, copy, and I'm going to go into Microsoft Outlook. Okay. So now we're in Microsoft Outlook. I want you to go to Tools, Options, and Mail Format. Go to Signatures. And right in here, I want you to right-click and paste it. Boom, it's in there. Okay, so let's go up to the social media icons and hyperlink it to the designated URL. So, I've already kind of found mine. So, I'm going to go up here, right-click it, copy, go to Microsoft Outlook, make sure it's selected, click on this right here, insert hyperlink. And, whoops, what is that? Let's delete this. I don't know what it did. <laughs> and paste it in there. Click OK. And let's go find the LinkedIn one. Select it, copy, or right click, copy. Go to Microsoft Outlook. Click on Insert Hyperlink. Go right here. Right click, paste. Click OK. Let's go grab the Twitter. Select it, copy, go to Outlook, click on the image, click insert hyperlink, and whoops, I don't know what it did there, but <laughs> make sure it's the right URL, paste it, and click OK. Now, if you're not sure if you did the right URL, just select it and click edit hyperlink. That's correct. That's correct. And that's correct. Okay. If I click OK, I now have an email signature with social media icons, and they are hyperlinked to their designated URL. So let's test it out just to make sure. I'm going to send it to myself. I should get it here shortly. And boom. Okay. I'm going to click on it, and I'm just going to click on one of them. Boom. There's my Facebook fan page. There's my link.